Hello, people. Another beautiful day. Yeah! It's Tuesday. But you know, we keep grinding around here. What's up with it? Hmm. So, the Steam Deck has a uh, dynamic cloud saves. Mm. Steam Deck. All right, let's get into this. Let's, let's do this. All right, listen to this. Says here, Steam Deck new cloud saves could be the system's best feature. It's talking about the dynamic cloud save. Says here, you should be able to pick up your games on your PC right where you stopped. Stop them on the Steam Deck. Okay? Says here, uh, <clears throat> ahead, uh, ahead of Steam Deck launch, Valve has, has detailed a new feature for Steam Deck cloud saves. That should carry over your progress from your uh, Steam Deck to your PC or another Steam or another Steam Deck. Even when you put your Steam Deck into a suspend mode without fully exiting a game, Valve has talked about this intriguing idea before. But now it has a, a name, Dynamic Cloud Sync. Hmm. Here's here's how it should work. When you put your Steam Deck into sleep mode, Dynamic Cloud Sync will automatically upload all modified saved games to the cloud. Valve explained a blog published Monday. That way you can pick up your save when you sit down at your PC or another device with Steam Deck. Another device meaning Apple, Linux, PlayStation, whatever, or Xbox. Anyway, the Steam Deck will also automatically download save games when you wake up the device. The feature sounds very uh, handy, and if it works, as advertised, it could make the myriads of mobile promise made by the Steam Deck feel attainable, seamless. Cloud saves is something rivals like like the Nintendo Switch have struggled with. But I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna cover that in another video right after this. But anyway, that said, Valve saves developers will have manually enable dynamic cloud sync in their games so it might take time for the feature to be available in some of your favorite titles and it's guaranteed to require required internet connectivity if dynamic cloud sync isn't enabled steam still will steam will still track progress make on your steam deck however any user who suspend their decks while your game is running and then tries to resume the, that game on a different device will be prompted to return to their deck to cloud to close the running process to or continue without most recent save games progress valve says in the past in the post intended for developers mm. and last paragraph dynamic dynamic cloud sync could be one of the steam deck best new features Hopefully, we won't have to wait long to try it for ourselves as the device February 2022 launch is nearly here. But if you haven't already secured a reservation, you might, you, you might, uh oh, screwing up here. So it says, uh, you might be waiting a bit longer to get your hands on handheld gaming PC as Valve expect orders availability for a new reservation is currently a vague after the second quarter 2022 end of article uh, this is about uh, this article is really about Valve improving the infrastructure of the Steam Deck and you're taking cues from Microsoft remember Phil Spencer came out and told everybody sales ain't the end all be all to video games the video, there's more to video games than sales. The video game industry is bigger than sales. So, when Microsoft was working on the infrastructure of the Xbox One, some some people were laughing, but I'm going to tackle that in another video. But anyway, and I guess um, Valve took cues from that. So, in today's video game industry, it's about infrastructure, it's about network, and it's about features. And that's what Valve is doing with the Steam Deck. You know, two about two days ago, I did I did a video where Valve was um, uh, improving the uh, the graphics GPU drivers for their for their rate for their uh, for for Linux for for uh, for the Radeon. 
and now they're doing dynamic cloud sync so Valve is just working on the infrastructure of the Steam Deck to make sure things run, run smoothly and this is good news to hear especially especially for you Mac users who plan to get a Steam Deck especially for you Windows users you Linux users of course and you PlayStation users and you um, Xbox users that, that's planning to get a Steam Deck. This is good news to hear. So this article was just all about infrastructure. And that's all Valve is doing right now. Taking cues from Microsoft <laughs> taking cues from Microsoft with Phil Spencer about 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 uh, infrastructure. So this was good news to hear. But anyway, what I'm gonna do is this. Let me know your thoughts and comments. I'm gonna leave a link in the description box with this article. Enjoy the video. Nice talking to you beautiful people again. Chris, still a Star Wars and Star Trek thing. Poor Dark Side. I'm gone. Peace.